rich line work can really enhance the uh, appearance of one's architectural presentation. And they also can bring out uh, additional meaning and, uh, and make it easier to understand and interpret the design. Um, Revit associates the line quality with the view, uh, which is different from many CAD systems. And this provides enormous expressiveness by uh, emphasizing and de-emphasizing de certain aspects of the design with the drawing. And this next series shows how to use display settings to enhance the quality of drawings. First, select an axonometric view. The property panel appears for the view. A key tool is the visibility graphics command. And I'll bring that up. And you see there's uh, tabs across the top here, model categories, annotation categories, analytical model categories, imported categories, and filters. Um, so these access different aspects of the uh, Revit model. Um, now, uh, you can also turn on a whole category with uh, these uh, buttons here. I don't want to see the analytical models. I don't have any imported ones, uh, so I could turn those off. And filters are really powerful, but I'm not going to get into them right now. I'm going to leave the annotation categories on and the model categories on. Now, first, I'm going to... Um, we don't need all this stuff, the air terminals, the uh, casework, the uh, duct fittings and stuff. So I'm going to uh, pick select all here and I'm going to turn everything off. Now, uh, now, if I were to display the model now, I would see nothing. And that's not quite what I want. I want to turn uh, various things back on the columns, the doors, um, the floors. Uh, I'm going to turn generic models on just because it can be useful. Uh, I'll turn the mass on for now, the conceptual mass objects. Um, I can turn the roofs on and uh, the stairs on. Uh, I'm not going to worry about those. Just realize the structural uh, elements are all clumped there. Uh, I'll turn the walls on and the windows on like that. Um, and we can see what that looks like now. And we see our model pretty well. Uh, now, um, 